Hi everyone and welcome to this short video. This is Lisa and as usual we're talking about narcissists. So honestly I think the the biggest thing when coming out of a narcissistic relationship or once you have especially once you've healed is that realization that truth that they just are not like normal people or let's not say normal healthy individuals they are not healthy individuals they don't think the same way uh, as a healthy individual and so that's what makes them hard to understand because you're trying to understand from a point of reason of logic there's nothing reasonable or logical about the narcissist so one of the biggest reasons that I say don't show the narcissist any emotion and other creators other coaches are gonna say the same thing don't show them any emotion because you are not going to elicit from the narcissist the emotion from them that you're looking for you're gonna get the opposite because it works like this when you're sad the narcissist is happy when you're crying the narcissist is laughing when you are just filled with anger the narcissist is filled with joy yeah or as close to joy and happy as they are capable of feeling because a narcissist is never truly happy with anyone but they're more unhappy alone which is why they're always searching for someone so as hard of a pill as this is to small to swallow you need to realize the narcissist is feeding on your pain by you showing them your emotions you are serving up everything they want on a silver platter so just remember the more emotion that they can pull out of you especially your tears your anger your sadness your anxiety your walking on eggshells all of that they're just sucking it up and that just feeding them like they're a vampire because they kind of are an emotional vampire and I know it can be really hard to do but your biggest defense against the narcissist especially if you're still with them as as, as hard as it might be try to not give them what they want which is you reacting